Hey everyone, Pastor Nathan here. We're continuing just working our way through Back to Basics from Foundation. This past week uh, for our sermon, we talked about the um, disciples on the road to Emmaus. And this coming week, we're, we're kind of quickly running to Jesus's ascension. And there's a few events that happen in the 40 days or so between Jesus's resurrection and his ascension. Um, one of them being Jesus's encounter with seven disciples um, who are fishing, who are going back to a life of fishing, if you will. This is recorded in John's Gospel, 21st chapter. Jesus, um, you know, has encountered the, the disciples, incredible catch of fish, all sorts of things happening here that are reflected sort of in his pre-death um, and resurrection ministry. But perhaps the biggest thing that's reflected here is Jesus' restoration of the apostle Peter. Um, Jesus asks Peter three times, do you love me? Uh, and, and each time Peter responds, yes, Lord, you know that I love you, um, or some variation thereof. This is important for a couple reasons. One is um, because Peter's restored, we also know that when we can fail in our following of Jesus, that, that we are not so far gone that he cannot restore us too, um, that he comes to us again and again and restores us. The second thing that, that that's sort of interesting in this section is that Jesus re reiterates the call, the original call that he had given to, to Peter um, when, when he restores him. He says, follow me. In restoring him and in telling him to follow him, he doesn't just simply restore him into that relationship. He re reiterates and reminds, um, here's your responsibility. Here's, here's what I've called you into, following me. So for us too, when, when, when Jesus returns and, and kind of re reconnects with us, let's say we, we have in either a part or whole sort of you know, walked away from him, gotten further away from him than we wanted to, or maybe even like Peter denied him or um, have, 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 have journeyed far from him, you know, Jesus then continues to come to us by his word, by the people around us, by his spirit and says, hey, follow me. You know, the call is still there for you. The, the, the restoration is still there for you. You can still be a part of this. This, this thing that um, ultimately glorifies God and brings you life um, as we follow Jesus. So um, I guess my, uh, my point with this is simply if, <laughs> if you're wondering what Jesus thinks of you, um, he loves you, he wants you to be near him, and wants you to follow him, even as he restores Peter and wants Peter to follow him and encourages these disciples along the way also to follow him. So also encourages us to follow him. And yeah, hope that's helpful for you today. We'll talk again soon.